Okay, we have your 10 dollars integral from the Scranton integration, be 2016 college final number eight. We have the integral of one minus x over the square root of one minus x squared dx. And I found this one to be really similar to a problem I did recently. I think I called it, don't overthink it. Because again, when I did this the first time, I definitely overthought it and missed the most obvious way to handle this. And so the way I wanna do this to get to a quick solution is let's just break it into two integrals because we've got the minus here in the numerator, that's gonna allow us to split this up. So for my first integral, we'll just have the one over the same denominator, one minus x squared. And then for the second one, I'll bring a minus out front and we'll just have our x over square root of one minus x squared dx. Well, for the first one, this is a really common integral and we just have a formula for this. This is actually just arc sine, so I'm just gonna write down, so we'll just go right to the solution for this and it's gonna be arc sine of x. Now for the second integral, it's not too bad either, because what I can do is a u substitution. I'm just gonna make my u equal to that, what's inside the square root there. So I'm gonna say u is equal to one minus x squared. I'll take a derivative of this thing. Derivative here is gonna be minus two x dx. Well, I already have the x in the numerator. I can take this minus and bring it inside here. And what I'll do is I'm just gonna create this two. And so I don't change it, we'll multiply by one half up front. So now we'll go ahead with this substitution. We'll write down, we have this one half. This here is exactly our du. So we're gonna have this as du over the square root of u. But then just to set up the power rule, I can rewrite this. I can write this as actually u to the minus one half du. So then we can just go ahead and integrate this, but let me copy down my arc sign. So we're gonna have our one half here. Integrating this with power rule is gonna give me u to the one half. Then we want the reciprocal of the exponent, which is just a two but I can cancel this two with the one half. And then just to finish it off, we just need to back substitute here with our u value. So for our final solution, we're gonna get arc sine of x. Then this one half power, I'm gonna write as square root of one minus x squared plus c, and that's it. Okay, good quick problem. We'll stop right there. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a great day.